overstepping is one of the key reasons for your failure in business. Today I have seen one gentleman who has been running different uh, outlets of uh, particular products and uh, last time I met him, I mean I, I have met him three four times, this is my fourth time I would rather believe, I would rather say I think it's the fourth time. I mean in the last uh, one and a half years he has scaled up his outlet, food processing unit, I mean he has got some food products, he has increased his outlets to eight in the last one year and three months. But today he was a different person than the person I saw six months back. I was really surprised. I asked him, hey friend, what happened to you? Why you look so dull? Because last time when I saw you were so energetic and you have a lot of enthusiasm in you, in your face. What happened? Then he told his story. What happened is, once he started his first uh, outlet, that was at a very prominent place and uh, he started running it very well. He went for the second one. And after the second one, I mean that was also becoming good, he went for the third one. The first one itself he was running at, uh, with uh, funding. The bank, uh, he has taken the bank loan and within six months he is going for the next outlet. In another three months he is going for the third outlet and everything is on funding. As you know, you can't get a complete loan on a regular basis without you, you proving your middle. They will take at least one year for analyzing your skill, analyzing your profitability, analyzing your future plans and everything. But this gentleman was starting everything within one year's time and he was quite sure that he is going to be successful. Of course, he has an excellent product also. What he did is he approached external lenders also at a, high, a very high rate of uh, interest. So what happened? Business was really picking up, uh, rather great business was picking up and uh, the money started rolling like anything and he thought I will have two more outlets because so many people who are coming from different areas were asking why are you not uh, short of opening your outlet in our place we have to come all the way from there to buy things here so so many things so and they were also saying your, your product is very you know very tasty and uh, we, we only thing is we have to come all the way from there to buy it so that was a big motivation for him, big moral booster for him and that is the reason he has tried to open, he not he has tried, he opened in different different locations. One in north, another one in east, and another one in south and another one in west like that. But, but the, when he was opening everything, opening stop, when he was opening this uh, outlets, the problem was that everywhere he has to reach. When he was scaling up the business, he was not able to scale up the employees. He was not able to scale up the people to go and reach everywhere. It was almost like one man show. So by the time he started the fourth outlet, the business was again, the money was rolling. Everything was really looking good. <clears throat> but what started have appearing is that he has not, he has started losing his cool, he has started losing his tempers because he was finding it very difficult to manage everything alone. He had some, some of his friends to manage it, but uh, as you, as you all know, I mean, uh, there is a, there is a limit to when you, when, when you, when you hire somebody who is not hired based on their, their quality, based on their ability. So it is really impossible for others to match this person's caliber because he has dedicated himself. He has so much of passion for what he is doing. So naturally there was an imbalance started happening. So from the fourth one onwards, the problem started. The problem started in the sense, I mean, there was issue on supplies. There was a problem on I mean, uh, uh, getting the product into various shops.
products getting into various shops. And there was also the problem of uh, uh, the, the employees sometimes taking leave. And because he is depending on some, uh, some of his friends as their employees, friends or friends' daughter or son, like that. And it was not that easy for him to talk to them openly and tell them, no, this is not the way that I want to run. And uh, so he has decided, when he, he decided to go for the sixth one, in between all these problems, he has decided to go for the sixth outlet. And in that sixth, when, even when he was having the sixth outlet, the employees have not gone up. The number of people who are managing has not gone up. <clears throat> Everywhere it required his brain. In fact, it required his physical presence also in some circumstances. Because there are some customers. What happens is when you are running a one-man show with the outlets improve, improving or growing, and uh, when you are trying to do everything by yourself, if you are not able to attend to one customer, the customer feels that for you, he or she is not important. So a lot of problems started uh, popping up. And unfortunately, he felt sick. He felt sick for nearly three weeks. He had a dengue and he felt sick for three weeks. And what happened after that was something unimaginable. He has not created a perfect system because he was running behind money. He was running behind the day-to-day -day affairs. He was running behind the day-to-day -day problems and was sorting it out. He has never thought of implementing a system. And moreover, he has taken a leap, big leap towards financing. So when he is not there, the system is started failing. The, pro the things did not move properly. The outlets, in some of the outlets, there was excess, excess stock. Whereas in other outlets, the stock was less. But uh, shifting from this uh, outlet to that outlet was not taking place in a an efficient manner. So ultimately it was a question of a volcano getting burst. Only the question was when it will burst. So it reached when it reached a point where after three weeks, after three weeks, when he was when he was barely able to move, when he started again coming to his shops, coming to his outlets. He could see that everywhere there is pile of problems, pile of stocks. In one area there is pile of stock, in another area nothing. And in one area the employees are uh, doing something over and over. In some areas employees are sitting idle. And the banks, the payment, repayments, the repayment has become a problem because you know, the rotation has been affected. Those customers who have been depended on him, who have been depending on him and who has been pricing his uh, service and his uh, quality and everything, they have started coming less. They are slowly, they have reduced coming here because they were coming here for him because he has made it, he has made it in such a way that only he can satisfy customers. Only he is the person who can make things happen. So naturally, when they can't find him, their comfort zone is gone. And moreover, he has some friends or who, at the, who, who has been appointed on the basis of recommendations. And uh, naturally, you can't expect somebody who has joined here and on recommendation to perform with a lot of passion and 100% uh, dedication. So it was going in for a big spin here. And he has started losing money heavily. And when I saw him, he closed his fifth and fourth shops and he was running with only three shops. But what are the loan? What are loans he has taken? That has not reduced. So the repayment has to be done using these three shops instead of those five, six shops he had. So the payment price, the payment crisis, management crisis, everything has happened. In the span of three months time now, today when I saw him, he was a man who almost lost everything. So the basic, the root cause of the problem I could identify because he scaled up too fast with too less people and too less planning. If you are, if you have, if you have, if you plan to go 
heavily and if you plan to do it uh, without any kind of planning then that is going to be a big big problem for the startups so think about it friends otherwise you will be ending up in deep problems please be careful if you want to know more about how to handle it just type yes i want to know below i'll help you out thank you